Hemoglobin matters in cardiogenic shock, and maybe more than we thought. There's a full breakdown of this article on my podcast, The Saving Lives Podcast. Make sure to check it out. But this study is a registry study that looked over 750 patients and found a clear trend. The lower the hemoglobin, the higher the mortality. Patients with a hemoglobin less than 11 had a 64% increase in one-month mortality and a 2.5-fold increase in one-year mortality compared to those with higher hemoglobin. This wasn't a subtle sign, it was statistically significant, and the trend held across all different groups. These anemic patients also had more comorbidities, more need for renal replacement therapy, and higher norepinephrine use. Bottom line, lower hemoglobin is associated with poor outcomes in cardiogenic shock. The authors call for randomized trials to define optimal transfusion thresholds. Hat tip to the authors. Don't forget to check out the Vasopressor and Inotrope Handbook.